What's up guys? Today we're watching season 4, episode 4 of Breaking Bad. So last episode was quite a bit, you know, Skyler was being pretty insistent with like Walt purchasing the car wash and you know he wasn't really doing anything about it but for like that whole episode she basically got the car wash for him. You know she had a whole plan, he was doubting it and in the end she ended up getting it for him which was awesome she was such a g for that she she did all the fucking work so props to her but also in the episode hank had a friend come visit him and he brought over the file that had freaking gail's lab notes because like the dude wanted him to look it over and i'm just scared because it's like sooner or later walter's gonna find out about it somehow or maybe he won't i feel like he will but it's like, how is that going to like affect shit, you know? I want to see what's going to happen with that. So I guess let's just get into the episode. Mike, are you in like a cooler thing? So they killed their own partner. What is about to happen? I thought he was about to get shot in the face. Swear to God. Mike better not end up dead, bro. Like, I feel like he's still gonna make it out because, you know, it's Mike. He's coming out of somewhere. Right? Period. Fuck y'all. see that man but they did shoot your ear that's horrible Ugh. you're going through that shit at 3 a.m. go to sleep woman the lies that leads you to just one more hand, one more spin, one more roll of the dice. And that Walter falling asleep. <laughs> so, tonight's the night. No turning back. Wait, y'all are gonna tell people? Like, come out with the gambling shit? Just well, you're not teaching them. I thought you wanted me to be thorough. Just play, you're taking too long. What, you don't think it behooves me to be able to explain any of it? It makes sense to explain it, but also not like every point in detail. It oh. Okay, let's see what I got. And 21. Damn. So he lost. Walt. It's not as if I don't know how to play. It's like he has to learn in one day how to do it. This is smart. You really want to try to sell a DEA agent some ill-prepared, half-assed, full whole story about how we suddenly have enough money to buy a car walk? I swear to God, she really like scripted this whole shit out. But I mean, it's kind of, they need to do that so they can... Make it believable to Hank. 
Did you take money, Walt? You remember Gretchen and Elliot? Because I seem to recall that you'd rather sell drugs than take help. Fine. She got a point. Story, it's a doozy, so hold on to your hats. Do you like that? Sure. <laughs> He's not taking this seriously, and I feel bad, but it is kind of like funny, but also not. To really hit the cancer, really touch on the fear and despair. It's good to remind them and to get their sympathy right off the bat. We want them to understand why you could do something so stupid. He doesn't really want the sympathy, but he's going to have to play into it to fool them. Okay, you're jumping ahead. Now, and why, and why am I so ashamed? Do I really need to answer that? He doesn't want to play bad guy, but... Providing for our family. There it is. Playing into his pride about it, but... I'm sorry. I'm sorry that I put you through all of this. That low key How's that sound? Oh. I thought he was seeming genuine about it, bro. And then he's like, nah. Feeling, you know? Just a just a suggestion. You might look down at the floor with remorse. It, it feels like they're putting on a play. That we can all support each other. And then maybe I'll tear up a little. I don't know. I'll just have to see what happens in the moment. I feel like it's not even going to play out like that. Like, she's making it out like a play and like rehearsing all these lines. But I feel like people are going to cut in and shit's going to get all mixed up and shit. But it could be wrong. And yes, I'm thorough. Maybe lying doesn't come as easily to me as it does to you. Uh, she keeps coming with them petty remarks, bro. Good. Oh, thank nice you, sweetheart. Shirt. Your Aunt Marie, she's cute, but uh, she could burn water, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> you are so very hilarious. Go show the boys your new rock collection. We're gonna get things organized. Yeah, it'll be- Her, his mineral collection. seven which takes it through a range of colors purple green blue but its most stable state is plus two which is usually pale pink why did hank look like that he's like i'm supposed to be explaining <laughs> like i checked this out i uh i've been working on stuff here i've done a little uh a little consulting uh you know uh weighing in on a case for the case oh fuck he's telling walt This guy. This is how he's finding out about Gail. It's such a relief to finally tell you. We're just so glad that we have a strong family to help us through this. We're already cutting to the point where they told them? Okay, maybe it didn't go wrong. Damn, Dad. Why'd you quit? I can totally get a car for my birthday now. Right? That's your reasoning? I thought you were going to say something else. Wow. <laughs> He's going through Hank's files. What if Hank finds them? Oh my fuck. Say you were you wanted to look at his mineral collection. I don't know. Or he didn't catch you in his room. You, know, you can always bend my ear, right? I mean, if you ever need to talk or or just blow off some steam, I'm I'm here. See, y'all both tell each other the same shit, but y'all never take each other up on it. Same goes for me, you know, if you ever want to bounce anything off me. 
I don't know, uh, casework, anything, really. He's hoping that maybe he would talk about Gail's case. Definitely not talking, you know, bathtub crank here. This is a big ass operation, you know, hundreds of pounds. Of so he's telling him about it. Okay. Cooks the purest meth that uh, me or anyone else has ever seen. Goes by the name of Heisenberg. It is so weird. He's in the same room as him, bro, and he just doesn't know it. Natto sugar. <laughs> it's a recipe for vegan schmores. Uh, there's all kinds of crazy crap in there. He was cool. Leave Gail alone. Here at the top says, uh, to WW, my star, my perfect silence. Walter White? I mean, who you figure that is, yeah? Woodrow Wilson? Oh. Walter White? I know he's just messing around, but it's like, <laughs> he said the truth, bro. In perfect silence at the stars. It's a poem by Walt Whitman. Your W did. Oh. Or maybe he just somehow made that up. I don't know. Me, personally. You know, I wanted to be the one to slap the handcuffs on him, that kind of shit. Popeye Doyle waving the frog one. I wonder if this is gonna be like a f like a foreshadowing moment because what if it is Hank that actually catches Walt? I don't know. You know something? They'll track down the shooter eventually. Jesse. So he's going to tell Jesse about it. I need to talk to you. Okay. Jesse shaved his head. Not mine. We done here? No, we are not done here. What if they are yours? How can you be so sure? I don't think they would be his because he didn't go in or anything. The only thing he touched was the gun. Jesse, would you pick up the casings? Did you pick them up? No. He was too stunned in the moment. He still fucked up about it, if you can't tell. Drove over there, you went to his door, right? Jesse, I need you to concentrate. This is very important. Did you knock? You're making him relive a day he doesn't want to. Did you walk into the room or did you shoot him right then and there? What? Who wants to make a hundred bucks? He's like pushing him about it and obviously they really kicked him out. But I mean, it's like I get it, but I also don't. Like, yeah, Jesse doesn't want to talk about it, but it's like they have to talk about it because it's being investigated. I was smart enough not to go down that particular road. Goose egg. Bup kiss. That's what the cops got. I wouldn't worry about it. He's gonna worry no matter what was I even going with that. He's gonna worry no matter what. I swear. I can't talk while other people are talking. I lose my train of thought. <laughs> I mean, how, how can I protect anyone? My family, Jesse, myself. The my name never comes up with those. <laughs> but at least he mentioned Jesse. It's like even though he's going through shit, he still cares about him. Skylar, I'm sure she believes she needs to believe that everything is neat and tidy. And she's telling herself that I work in this nice. You're basically doing the same thing. You have to make sure everything is neat and tidy so y'all don't get caught. So. Back pocket really got to protect yourself uh, disappear Poof. 
he never thought about disappearing like that because of his family. For a substantial fee, and I do mean substantial, you and your loved ones can vanish, untraceable. I mean, he sets you up with a whole new life. Okay, so he said and loved ones, so that's a plus. Frequencies and microwaves and cell phones and stuff are getting you. I mean, you could be strolling through security at the airport on your way to visit your grandma or- hey, wake up, bitches! And then you get- Bro was talking to someone who is full on sleeping. It's risky to keep your money in there, bro. Like, I'm scared what's gonna happen to that money. Like, nothing's happened so far, but. They really be following Jesse. So they mostly think Jesse, they think that Jesse's more of a hazard. I thought they would mostly put up that for Walt in a way, but no, it's Jesse. What did I tell you, bro? Your money is gone. And you don't seem freaked out by it. Gotcha. You're really playing games and just not even going to care about it? With your ear. I knew it was probably Mike. No. You ought to. He's been at your house for three solid days. <laughs> okay. He stole your money. So he stole the money. You want to know what's next for little Miss Pissed in his pants? No. You sure now? Yeah. Don't even want to take a wild guess. He's just going to keep following me around. I'm not going to say, is that what your little show here was all about? You're on thin ice, you little shithead. He's also been going through a lot, but maybe someone should put him in his place. I don't know. I'm sorry to keep you waiting. How's the year? Mending. I feel like I haven't seen Gus in so long. He's become increasingly incautious. He's a risk, a liability. I know he and Walter come as a team and that Walter won't- They were just talking about him becoming a risk. Oh God, what's gonna happen to Jesse? for the thing right what's happening hey it's me wait for the thing oh great i don't understand what's happening did he get a message from someone or oh wait no he was late he wasn't even there with Walt. Don't you fucking tell me that they took Jesse. I swear to God. Where are they taking him?
A, ask where we're going? a ride with Mike is never a good sign. Oh, come on. No. So that's literally how you're going to end the episode. And ugh. I feel like they're just about to put him in his place. But also with Mike, you know, he's he's a violent person. So you never know. But ugh, I swear to God, it's like I want to root for Jesse, but he's also been in a bad place. So I can see where... Mike was coming from telling Gus something because he does seem to be more high risk since he's like barely giving a fuck in the world but I feel bad to see like if something bad is gonna happen to him like if it's his death I'd be terrified but I don't know if it's gonna come to death we gotta wait and see for the next episode but I swear it's like <sighs> Jesse's never gonna catch a break and but the like I was saying earlier he kind of put himself in this situation but he's also been in a bad place you know this line of work is just not for Jesse he needs to leave he needs better mental health like his mental health is what got him here in the first place because if he didn't have to kill Gail and then have like all that guilt and shit with him he probably wouldn't be in this position right now, but he did, and bam, look at him now, on a ride with Mike to God knows where. But I didn't expect, like I kind of did expect, but I also didn't expect Hank to show Walter the case that he's working on with like Gail and shit. Cause it's like being a DEA agent and shit, you're not supposed to show outside people or whoever something about a case and yeah he trusts walt but one look who walt is he's the person that he's actually searching for and two it's like just because you like really trust him they he's not a cop or whatever so you can't you're not really supposed to show people like that the freaking shit but he did and now walt knows that like hangs on his ass and like has the fucking shit with freaking Gail like he has the lab notes and everything and it's like you know Hank just keeps giving himself away because him talking to Walt he just keeps giving him the heads up about everything like whenever freaking he was going to get Jesse I want to say it was like last season yeah last season and then they were stuck in the trailer or whatever before it got demolished like Walt got a heads up that he was going after Jesse in the first place in a way and then this situation it's like Hank keeps giving him the information that he needs to keep them from getting caught and it's like yay good for us good for our main character but also he's hurting his like Hank is hurting his own case like mm, if he just kept that shit to himself and like just talked about it with like the people that he worked with he probably would have caught Walt by now because he wouldn't have known that they were gonna go after Jesse and shit, you know? But that's just Hank's, Hank's fault. But you can't help that he trusts them because you know, their family and everything. It's just so much fucking happening. I just, like they even already like, they're going along with their story about Walt gambling and shit to cover up Walt's meth making and Loki, I didn't think that they'd ever really, like, come out about, like, the gambling shit. Like, yeah, they told Marie, but I didn't think that they were going to tell anyone else, but they did. So, yeah, that's covering their ass right now, but we're going to see how long that's going to work. <sighs> I've been talking really fast. The show got my mind going, but I, I'm ready to see what's going to be happening with Jesse mostly so I guess come back for episode 5 <laughs>